It's the hot new Apple iPhone 16, and if you've ordered one, beware. Porch pirates have figured out how to grab your phone moments after it's delivered. As Allison Hall reports, authorities believe it may be an inside job. These porch pirates are all apparently after one thing, the new iPhone 16. Doorbell cams across the USA are catching thieves in the act, just minutes after the hot new iPhones get delivered. The porch pirates are reportedly targeting AT&T phones, which generally don't require a signature upon delivery. In this case, the FedEx driver drops the package at the front door, and that's when this guy swoops in. Some thefts are even becoming dangerous. In this disturbing video, a lowlife wearing a face mask and carrying a gun yanks an iPhone from the front porch. As he flees to the getaway car, he brandishes the firearm at a neighbor mowing the lawn. Cops say this teenager flew all the way to Houston from Chicago just to steal iPhone 16s from the doorsteps of local homes. Lindsay Lorio says her iPhone 16 was delivered to her house outside Houston, and it was snatched right off her doorstep by this guy, who calmly walks away while chit-chatting on his phone. FedEx delivered it at 3.30, and at 4.30, someone walked up to my front porch, didn't look around, knew exactly where the phone was, and took it from my front porch. How would this person know that your iPhone would just be sitting there? That I do not know. I had a bunch of Amazon boxes that were in view of the street that no one touched. Police say in some cases it could be an inside job. Apparently, the pirates have inside information like tracking numbers. Lieutenant Kenneth Lacey of the Yonkers Police Department in New York says they've seen an uptick in iPhone thefts since the new iPhone was released last month. This doesn't sound like these are just regular porch pirates getting lucky by finding an iPhone. This is something a little deeper than that? This is definitely deeper. Given the time that this is delivered and how quickly they're being stolen, um, and then other things that we've learned in our investigation, it's a very organized effort by many, many individuals. AT&T says they require signatures in several high theft markets and offer all customers in-store pickup, adding they ship tens of thousands of packages every day without incident. FedEx says they regularly remind drivers to remain vigilant and report unusual activity. Both companies say they are working with law enforcement.